What's good guys, Fury Fire here and today we've got a match between two of my favourite Japanese players, Proud Strawberry playing as Goken versus Awari playing as Honda and uh, this footage is from Yoga Flame 24 as always and uh, I really enjoy this matchup as a Honda player myself even though it is quite heavily in Goken's favour. Um, Goken as you all know has improved recovery on his Dukens making it really hard for Honda to get in on the floor and he also has angled um, fireballs which if he hits you with he can then follow up with a palm which will send you full screen pretty much all his anti airs apart from crouch fierce send you full screen or at least set you up for a meaty attack I mean Honda is bad in every sense of the word in this matchup um, he has slightly better footsies than Goken he can deal more damage from like mid-ish range uh, Goken has to be in an advantageous position to deal damage to you at a close range Honda in a neutral close is actually really good um, due to the obvious hand links and uh, stand roundhouse and stand fierce so you're going to be looking for Awari to find a way in and Proud Strawberry is probably going to want to keep him out unless he gets a sort of situation in which he feels comfortable to push in uh, like a knockdown when Honda doesn't have meter or he has specific safe jump setups to stop headbutts which I'm sure he does so uh, let's get straight into this both characters going with Ultra 1 Goken so he can react to headbutts E Honda so he can react to fireballs and uh, let's see how he starts out straight away with a headbutt just gets stomped by that stand fierce and Awari is going to be playing quite erratic here because getting in once is going to be a big deal and here we go he's going to make Proud Strawberry guess going in once again Proud Strawberry not getting the anti-air but he does get the forward throw and he's going to get a setup and uh, just into a tick throw and there you go he's baiting out all those headbutts doesn't want Awari to be, feel comfortable headbutting randomly and uh, there you go he's got a full screen to work with just trying to predict a upward fireball you're only going to see him throwing those angled fireballs when Awari wastes his charge if he walks forward then you're comfortable to do it if not he can just reaction ultra or headbutt through easily and uh, Awari's in a good position here he's got him in the corner misses the link but uh, takes a throw and uh, Awari's just playing a little bit careful he's very low one more hit's going to finish it out doesn't get a link into super unfortunately and uh, Kraus Robbie just finish, finishing out with that amazing crouch short. Uh, Awari may have been able to do a little bit more damage there if he had super, but I don't think he had back charge and the full hands didn't connect anyway. And uh, Kraus Robbie just going in fearless and he's going to throw Awari full screen here. Is he going to go for Oki or just keep away? He's staying away and uh, just waiting for him to walk forward. As soon as he does, throws out those fireballs. Wow, nice demon flip into the throw here. He's going for the mix up. Awari just jabs him out of it. Fantastic play, but doesn't get any kind of follow up. And he's once again at full screen, having to walk in on Proud Strawberry, which you do not want to do versus Goken. Uh, just trying round some headbutts to try and react, like get a uh, fireball, just catch it off guard on the start up. Gets another set up. Awari tries to auto correct headbutt, but unfortunately just goes straight under him and he's once again he's at the neutral game now this is where he wants to be and unfortunately Proud Strawberry just throws him out once again this is the definition of the losing battle for Honda it's so difficult to do anything versus Goken and uh, any little bit of chip here and there you go he just finishes it out predicts that jump and um, I think one thing you have to bear in mind as a Honda player is you've got to look for when the opponent is watching your charge uh, is a really good determinant uh, it's really good to determine how good they are so if you see them do something like in that example Gokim was throwing upward fireballs and fireballs particularly when Honda didn't have charge because Honda couldn't then react to you throwing an upward fireball and just headbutt you for free get meter or get a dash in for free so because he, he walks forward throws those fireballs as a Honda player you need to recognize whether the opponent's doing that and if they are doing that kind of keep it in mind and try and stay on the floor especially in this matchup because you saw that there was many an example of a goat of Proud Strawberry just throwing those angled fireballs I can't remember like I don't think he threw any sort of low fireballs apart from full screen and you know you can do that versus Honda because you got fantastic recovery if you got meter you're probably going to get free anti-air if he jumps in on you 
So it's something you have to bear in mind. See what how he reacts to you walking forward and not having a charge. A lot of players like to jump at you, so you have to have like normal anti-airs on point. And some players like to predict jumps like that. And maybe you just want to walk in and do a stand roundhouse. Or maybe dash in and get an Ocho. Something along those lines. Just make sure you change up how you're approaching and see if they're reacting to what you're doing. Like the best way to actually keep away a Honda is instead of playing preemptively, actually just react to everything he does and out footsie him. If you've got a character that's got good footsies, you've probably got a good movement speed. So you can just walk back and forth, bait out that crouch roundhouse, get a sweep and push him away. You know, it's quite easy to out footsie Honda. He does have really good pokes, but you've got the advantage of good movement speed typically. So, you know, Honda's movement speed isn't great. He works on basis of getting burst damage and you doing stuff that's stupid or just getting random lucky stuff. So you just have to keep that in mind. Try and play consistent versus Honda. That's my advice. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you soon. Peace.